brown skin girl with the high waist shorts. Yeah, hey, with a makeup on, pressing on the triggers. See, they wanna ride the way to can surf like us. They can surf like us, so no, with a brown skin girl with the high waist Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's me, Bemi. If you're new, welcome. And if you're not new, thanks for coming back and tuning into my channel. So today I'm going to be reviewing this wig I have on my head right now. This wig is from a company called Wow Ebony and it came in a box like this. It comes with an elastic band, which is what I'm using to secure the wig on my head right now. So no, it's not glued on. I literally just, you know, used the um, elastic band and just popped it on my head. I'm gonna be showing you how I transformed this wig from being a color 1B to what I have on my head right now. And also I'm gonna show you how I styled the wig, how, you know, um, cause when the wig came, it was actually quite long. I think it was 20 inches, but then I wanted it shorter. So I cut the wig to be this length. So if you wanna see how I achieved this, um, this wig transformation and please stay tuned and keep on watching okay so the wig comes with four combs on the inside to help you secure the wig on your head but i didn't really end up using the um combs i took them off and the wig also comes with elastic bands on both sides at the back for my mixture i'm using a 40 volume developer with white bleach powder and what i'm doing right now is i'm just applying i'm just putting some of the bleach powder into the container and then I'm applying the 40 volume developer. I'm just going to keep applying the developer until I feel like I have the right consistency. So right now I'm just using my brush to mix the powder and the developer together. As you guys can see this consistency is very very thick. So I'm going to go ahead and add some more of the developer. And also I'm adding the silk, the um, purple shampoo to help get rid of the brassiness while I'm bleaching the hair. This step is not really necessary but you know it's just... A way of just I don't know like I, I don't know why I decided to add the um <laughs> the shampoo but right now as you guys can see this is the right consistency that I need so I'm just passing the hair into two right now I didn't realize that my camera was not recording while I was bleaching the other side so I'm parting the hair into two and I'm just applying the bleach all over the hair I didn't end up using the brush I just you know just applied the bleach all over the hair anyhow and one thing I really like about this hair is that it took so well to bleaching and the hair literally started lifting in less than 10 minutes which is so good I don't know if you guys can see but the part where I just applied the bleach is already lifting and it's like basically brown so I didn't leave the bleach on the hair for too long because the other side had already bleached and I didn't want the hair to be too bright so as soon as I was done applying the bleach I washed it out so right now i've turned the wig inside out and i'm applying the bleach onto the lace to help it look more natural once i was done with that i then washed out the bleach from the hair with just water now i'm applying some of that purple shampoo to help get rid of the brassiness from the bleaching and you just want to wash out the bleach as much as you can so just keep washing until you feel like all the bleach is gone but now i'm just applying the conditioner all over the hair i left it for like 10 to 20 minutes and then washed it out After washing out the conditioner, I popped the wig back onto the mannequin head and now I'm just cutting the hair. I didn't want the hair to be too long, I wanted it really short so yeah that's why it's at this length that you guys can see. And that's the end of the video guys, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did please give this video a thumbs up, don't forget to check the description box down below for any information that you need. And I'll catch you guys in my next video, bye! Where I wish I could get up, brown skin girl.